the EBRD Business Advisory Services Program has been operating in Central Asia since 2001. Uh, what we do breaks down into basically two major streams of work. Uh, the first is uh, supporting consulting projects for individual enterprises, and the second is market development activities, specific activities that we undertake to help build a professionalism in the consulting markets. On the project support side, what we're doing is uh, using a, a facilitation and subsidi subsidy mechanism to help local enterprises, small and medium enterprises, hire local business consultants to undertake consulting projects. The BAS program covers half of the cost of the consulting project, so the enterprise has to uh, put in a significant uh, cost sharing. Uh, but nevertheless, the BAS program is there to uh, help reduce that financial barrier to undertaking a first consulting project for, for an enterprise. In addition to the money, though, the BAS program is also providing an, uh, a whole package of services that involves helping the enterprise define the project, come up with terms of reference and a budget and a contract, and most importantly, also selecting a qualified consultant for the project. On the, uh, the second stream, this um, uh, market development activities, what we're undertaking are specific interventions that allow us to help uh, increase the professionalism uh, and also the ethical awareness of uh, the consultants here locally. Uh, we're working locally with um, institutes of management consulting. These are associations of management consultants that we've helped uh, facilitate, uh, helping them put together programs of continuous professional development. In addition to that, we're also helping the local institutes become members of an international body uh, that will then grant them the right to certify consultants locally according to an international certification, which is called a uh, certified management consultant. The BAS program has been operating uh, the longest in Kazakhstan and Uzbekistan, where we started working in uh, 2001. Uh, in total, in those two countries, we've uh, supported more than uh, 1,500 uh, projects in the past nine years. And uh, the program in Kazakhstan is now continuing at a rate of about uh, 12 projects uh, per month. So these are individual consulting projects that we're helping to initiate and uh, to actually uh, implement. So about 140 projects per year in the case of Kazakhstan. Uh, the programs in the neighboring countries are uh, somewhat smaller, but uh, I would argue potentially even more significant for the size of the economies that they are. Uh, in uh, Kyrgyzstan, we're undertaking uh, close to 80 projects uh, a year. In Tajikistan, around 70 projects. Uh, and in Turkmenistan, where we're just going to be starting soon, uh, we hope to be undertaking between uh, 30 and 40 projects uh, per year. In all of these countries, what we're doing uh, in terms of uh, the regional allocation of our projects is to do at least 80% of our projects outside of the capital cities in the regions where arguably the enterprises are located that really uh, need the program the most, the underserved enterprises that have the least access to consulting services.